The show on RCMP spoke to the mayor and council this afternoon at the district's regular council meeting. Topics included the results of the past year with the RCMP and plans and goals for the future. We're last year 595 violation tickets. That's actual money the violation tickets or notice and orders, just a warning. Um, if you equate that into eight, nine, ten members that should be out on the road per member, that's not very much. Um, we're trying to be more visible, get out there, uh, what we're going to do with the traffic initiative this year, uh, more roadblocks. Um, we're going to have the static, like in town, up on the highway, like Dawson Creek when they have an event. A lot of people come through, they have been drinking, uh, speeding, so we're going to sit up on the highways. Um, we're going to have guys come in so they adjust their shifts for special events. I think the Sakanka Awakening, I think, might go ahead. So we're going to have more bodies out for the traffic enforcement with that. Uh, we just want to be here in town, you know, cell phones, we've had complaints, the cell phones, seat belts, you name it, so we're, we're going to be more visible in town. Um, with uh, also impaired driving, um, we're trying to, if we had 55 charges last year with the IRP, we're trying to increase that with uh, more so criminal code as well. Because um, the immediate roadside prohibition is, you know, you're 30 day impound, 90 day uh, driver's license suspension. Um, but we're seeing a lot of uh, more people that have had a list of criminal offenses and they, they're they not getting the point, I guess. So we're going to take them to court. 